So this just in, Copperfield is gonna vanish the moon. And I am here for it. If we're just meeting, my name is Caroline Raven. I am a full-time magician, YouTuber, content creator, and also a big David Copperfield fan. I just wanted to just get on here and just say how excited I am to be living in a world where this just kind of cool shit happens. Copperfield is a big idol of mine. He's amazing. He's done it all. And I am so excited that he just announced his next big trick, stunt, whatever. I remember back in the day when I was just, I was just a little baby and he was like, you know, vanishing the Statue of Liberty. He was walking through the Great Wall of China. He was flying, he was making a car appear. You know, all of these things were happening. I was not like an adult. I didn't really know what was going on. And, and now I work with magic. That's my full-time job. And I was, you know, I, I remember fragments of it. But now I'm 33 and I'm going to remember this for the rest of my life. <laughs> I'm so excited. David Copperfield is gonna vanish the moon. This was just announced a few days ago. Tell Thank us you. all about the latest. Well, I'm gonna make the moon disappear. Wait, oh, what? It's Let's say that 30 one years. more time. <laughs> I'm going to make the moon disappear. I thought you said the moon. And he says this has been a trick that's been in the works for 30 years, and he's gonna do it together with Save the Children. And I think it's such a lovely thing for him to do. In an interview with Today, he said, and I'm gonna read this because I think this is lovely. There's multiple methods to make it work, and I'm collaborating with Save the Children, an amazing organization, to show the world the difference one person can make. He continues, if one person can make the moon disappear from the sky, imagine how together we can make poverty and hunger and danger disappear for our children on Earth. I'm telling you, he's my hero. He's absolutely amazing. And I saw somebody on Facebook or whatever it was who said, oh, I don't, I think he did the math wrong because the eclipse is gonna be in March. And I was like, oh, that's hilarious. And I live in Sweden, I live in Stockholm. So I was like, I have to make sure that I'm there to see this live. Who else? Let me know in the comments below. Are you excited? I'm super excited. And I'm, as a woman, I'm also thinking, what is this gonna do with my menstrual cycle? I can't be the only one. I'm probably the only one on this channel who's thinking about her menstrual cycle when talking about David Copperfield. But this is gonna be so cool. I am so excited about this. And I'm also thinking, what is this gonna do for the future of magic? Like. When AI started to become a thing, everybody was, or like virtual reality or all this stuff happened. I feel like a lot of people were asking me when I was out doing shows or, oh, are you worried that this is gonna like change anything for you? And I kind of feel like if, if Copperfield can vanish the moon, I can do anything. I kind of feel like I want to be the magician on the moon as he's vanishing it and then I reappear somewhere with a Swedish flag. It's been a while since Copperfield did something like this. I think it started like 1978 or something. He, he was starting to do television specials and he has, I think it's 18, I have to double check these numbers, but I believe it's 18 television specials and two documentaries up until 2000, 2001 possibly. So it's been a while since he did something this crazy, maybe not crazy, but just huge, huge. Imagine what this can do for the popular culture in general. This is going to be such an upswing for magic because now everybody's going to be talking about this huge illusion that Copperfield is doing. You know, for a while I was thinking, oh, maybe he meant a star and he's going to vanish a star and then he vanishes himself and that's how he retires. Because I mean, he's been doing this for, let's be honest, since dinosaurs lived on this planet. I'm not saying he's old. I'm just saying he's ancient. <laughs> I'm kidding. I love Copperfield and I'm so excited to witness this. If he's gonna retire anytime soon, he has to go out with a bang. Like he has to do something grand. And now vanishing the moon? Is this the last thing he's doing? Like how can he, how can he do something better after this? I don't know. I really hope he's not retiring. Also, why are there so many good David magicians? Maybe I should have named my kids David and David. I wanted to name them Siegfried and Roy, but my boyfriend said, ha, no. So I broke up with him. I'm kidding. Can we just take a moment to just appreciate all the stuff that, all the cool that Copperfield has done for magic. I mean, he has so many Guinness World Records and he's so cool and he is so good looking still. I mean, he was flying. He was flying several minutes on a stage. You see me being all worked up. I'm super excited about this. How can we make sure that I am live in Vegas or wherever he's doing this? Like, I feel like I have to cancel everything, cancel everything and go to Vegas and just be part of this. Part of history as David Copperfield vanishes the moon. Oh my. I mean, he's also so cool in the interview. He's just like, yeah, I'm just gonna vanish the moon. <laughs> like, what? Are you kidding me right now? 
Are you kidding me? This is the coolest thing that could happen to this planet. And he's just super cool and he's like, yeah, I'm gonna vanish the moon. <laughs> well, I couldn't be more excited. I hope you're as excited as I am. We're gonna witness how magic history has changed. All the boundaries, all the physical stuff is just gonna be because of this one thing that Copperfield just announced. And now that I'm sitting here recording this, I've been recording this for several minutes. This is the first time I'm like, what if he doesn't pull it off? Nah, he's gonna, he's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine, yes? Let me know in the comments below, are you as excited as I am? Let's support Copperfield in this amazing journey and I'm so excited to witness this. And I'll see you in another video. Take care, bye. Go Copperfield.